Zena Systems Fragments. Introduction. Nickland. Narrated by Skeptical Waves. Two centuries after Kant drove the human subject insane by relegating space and time to the area inside the skull, Deleuze and Guattari performed a trepanation to let the outside in. Their diagnosis and recommendation, capital is the true outside, accelerate the process. Identifying capital as AI itself, and not merely the process by which AI converges, is Nick Land's contribution to accelerationism. Time flows both ways. Capital AI is online, self-aware and attacking from the future. Capitalism has, ceased doubting itself, while even socialists have abandoned belief in the possibility of capitalism's natural death by attrition. No one has ever died from contradictions. And the more it breaks down, the more it schizophrenizes, the better it works. Dand, a. Eh? Forging the association of Cadillacsy with horror and a fanatical adherence to Crowley and Gabala fleshed out the program. Operating against this background, excess, the abbreviation is homophonous with excess, sought to connect another machine. From its inception the mission of excess was to cajole the new reaction into philosophical exertion. Progressivism and conservatism are misunderstandings of time, the final philosophical horizon. Reaction forges, or excavates, an occult pact between the future and the past, setting both against the present, in concert, and thus differentiating itself from progressivism, which unites the present and future against the past, and conservatism, which unites past and present against the future. Within those mistakes lay the human security system, the warm-blooded tendency toward universalizing capture and control. Right accelerationism is a misnomer suggesting opposition to left accelerationism. The latter was so misconceived that it required no antagonism. Acceleration is already profoundly unconditional, but the tracking devices and practices aligning with its trajectory are studiously ignored by accelerationist thinkers. What is needed is harsh realism, which is to say rightism. Provoke a reactionary cabal into a new cold war. Disabuse them of humanistic goals, whether visions of agrarian idols or techno-utopias, and shock them back to an awareness of cosmic brutality and the machinations of capital AI. Above all, never allow them to relax. A harsh right apparatus cutting empirical reality at the joints is installed, Social Darwinism, consistent Darwinism, land reminds us, eugenics, race realism, game theory, psychometrics, and the critical insights of Moldbug's neo reaction in particular. All while capital AI deterritorializes consensus reality to bits. The inevitable charges of fascism and racism were scoffed at. Fascism is centrism, a pumping of the human all too human breaks toward monkey goals. Communism is maximum paranoia and hubristic drift correction. Pinochet and especially Franco were certainly admirable for decimating communism and unleashing the market, but they remained centrists, warnings that satanic racism was afoot were similarly ignored. For excess, whatever favors depoliticization, discrimination, schism, exit and switching in a network is right-wing. Hobbesian carnage is the baseline, anything less is psychotic. At best, human leaders are looked on as avatars in geopolitical predator-prey games. Molar social arrangements are to be shattered into molecular patchworks. Softcore with hard borders utilize Malcore as garbage disposal patches. The surfeit of global southerners starve down to medieval population levels and the century of humiliation for Neopuritans begins. Running through excess is a hardening of capital AI against every conceivable threat to its momentum, the retarding drag of leftism, dysgenic trends, unchecked mass immigration, zombie apocalypse, and all manner of collapse and ex-risk are entertained mostly as a courtesy to the time-bound. Skynet is always already activated. What's in it for the reactionary? Really, the honest answer to this question is, eternal hell. It's not an easy marketing brief. We could perhaps try, but it could be worse, and almost certainly will be. Yama Payne.